just to comment over a couple of clips and then I have a little commentary ramble thing. Um, just showing the damage difference between when you can punish the guy if you were to save your RC for later after the punish versus if you were to drift RC in whatever the fuck you want to call it and then punish. And you can see there is actually a, a fairly noticeable damage difference depending on what you do. And I guess if you were to think about the game in terms of, you know, it's not super realistic to always be counting the wall. It could even be a problem because you could save your meter for potentially too long, depending on where you are on the screen. And then if you watch those old videos, like I talk about, then you accidentally RC'd and you didn't even need to RC because the wall was going to break anyway. Um, and another comment too, because you know, I've been showing a lot of these counter hit things because in a way it's kind of like the most interesting thing about the game that you have this counter hit system that now in this game is an actual time system. And then you add that with the RC kind of slow down thing with the drift RCs. It adds like doubly kind of punish scenarios because you can combo a lot of stuff that is then doubly the combo. <laughs> what the fuck you want to call it? But of course, this, this game is a little bit weird because if you think about it, then on another level, you got to remember just because the game says punish doesn't mean it will always give you a counter hit. So even if you drift RC in, you do not necessarily get the counter hit drift RC, which gives you even double the time because you're adding it together. So that's a caveat that uh, I guess I should mention if it's not obvious from watching the videos. Um, a couple of other things too. Why the fuck does Chip get a special counter hit on his Dragon Punch, but Kai's Dragon Punch does not get a, a, a special counter hit? That is very bizarre to me. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck. Why does the Dragon Punch character actually not get the counter hit bonus on his Dragon Punch? That's really fucking weird to me. I, I don't know. I don't know what to do with this game. Honestly, you know, like I said, it's kind of old. The game is two years old at this point. So I just feel like I'm just reiterating everything. And I feel like a lot of people, as you can see, are just basically posting what I said the game was going to work like already. So it's already kind of dull to me. And uh, I said this before, this is the kind of game that I would rather actually play than do combo stuff for. And uh, I just think, you know, it's a weird game to me because I think that uh, the game is two years old and it's kind of like there's some ideas here, but they didn't really think the ideas through despite the game being two years old, which is kind of weird to me. But... Um, Anyway, uh, yeah, I don't know. Maybe I'll do a live stream and we can talk about this game, but I'm kind of getting over it. I, I don't really know what to post, really. I mean, because, again, it just seems like stuff I already said almost two years ago about how the game was going to work. So, anyway.